know if you guys can hear me with the wind, but I'm gonna have to end the episode here. Got one on the board. Oh, no. oh, oh, shark. Shark. oh, there we go. We're on. We are on. Welcome back, everyone, to another episode. We got the car in the background with the tinny. Where are we going today? So, I've been wanting to come to this place with the tinny for quite a while. Pretty much since last year when I came, we're going to Cape Palmerston. I've got uh, a navigator here, Rafaldi, he's in the back. We are going to take the tinny along the beach all the way into the boat ramp. It's not really a boat ramp, it's a bit of a sketchy boat ramp, but I'm going to risk it to get the biscuit because what I want to do is fish off these um, rock ledges. I've seen them on the map and I've heard a few stories about people going there and catching some blueies. That's our target fish today, some blueies. We've got the cruiser and the tinny. Everything's ready to go. Ask me if we've forgotten things. Yes, we have. We've forgotten the cast net. We've got bait. We've got everything. We're on. Let's get it. Yo! You got first fish, Rafa? Fucking mate. First fish, mate? All the fish. All the fish, probably. <laughs> That's probably what's gonna happen. We're just about to get on the beach now and um, I didn't bring any max tracks and my winch isn't ready yet so let's hope I don't get bored. <laughs> found ourselves a little camp site and we're actually spoiled for choice because uh, there's no one here. That's the best, best thing that could happen. A little bit windy, but we are right on the point. I uh, can't remember what creek it is. I'll throw the name of the creek down there, but um, let's do a makeshift boat ramp in Cape Palmerston. If you know where it is, you know what I'm talking about. So we have snagged an awesome spot. You know, <laughs> you get real lucky sometimes when you come here when everyone else is working and you're on holidays so that's that's number one hot tip but uh, so I think our plan is now we're just gonna set up a little bit half set up camp put the boat in put it under anchor and then uh, we can kind of muck around set up camp properly I just wanted to get the boat in the water so we're not mucking around with it later half setting up camp all that sort of business so we're gonna try and put it in now then set up camp enjoy until the tide comes in about two or three o'clock ish and then we're going to put the boat in scoot around do some exploring because i have been here maybe three or four times before um in my old tinny my very first tinny and i can't really tell you that i remember those times because they were pretty um a lot of alcohol involved anyway this time, sober, better sounder, better equipment. Really want to have a look up and down this river. Uh, this is a bit of a croc river also, got to keep an eye out there. But mainly I want to scoot around the front where all this cliff is and see if we can fish for some blueies. All right, time to put the boat in. Bungs are in. Bungs are in. We know that you, much. You heard it here first. Bungs are in, people. There we go. There we go. Probably from the other night, mate. Still not on properly. Yeah, that's probably the reason. Yeah, that's probably the reason.
know, after a bit of waiting, trying to wait for this tide to come back in, we've poked our head out the front where we wanted to try and fish for blueies. Now, I've only got a 3.7 meter tinny. I don't really want to push too much with two of us in here. It got a little bit too choppy. I didn't record it, but it's one of those things. I didn't want to put us at risk. We're having fun. I just punched it, we punched it back in. And now we're just trawling the creeks here. The wind might drop down as the sun goes down. So we might try again, but again, first time still using all this gear. So I still want to be safe in what I do and I want to get home in one piece. So we're just going to fish around the mouth of the creek. Hopefully the wind dies down. We might poke our head out the front again, see what happens. But I'll check in if we do something. Said it before in a couple other videos, but pretty lucky. Look at this. Holy sunset over the water. Someone called Barry. Whoa. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Waiting all day for it. It's little, but we're on. Rafa's got it. He's breaking the curse for today. What do we got? Little Grunty. Rafa with the goods. Little hook, mate. Get some. Hey? Not bad at all. And then we got that as the background. Jeez. Oh my goodness. We're sitting on a bit of a hole right now. Trying to figure out. No, I'm not going to say we're not trying to figure out. We've figured out where we're doing. We're just waiting for this puppy over here to go down. And uh, those fish are just getting on the chew straight up. We are on. Let's do it. Again. Another grinder. Bit bigger. Same size. Rafa. On, mate. Oh, that's the, that's why they call them the grunter. They fucking they grunt. Listen to it. And I've yet to catch one. He's just throwing them in, and getting bites straight away. I need to focus on catching a fish. To be really honest, he's on again, Rafa. Three times in a row, mate. No, another little grunter. Catch something one. big, mate. That, that took me rod too. That, that took you rod. That was quite the fight, man. It's only a little, little red, but. Well, at least you're catching something, mate. Here I am. Rafa's rod. Catching nothing. Oh, we got double hookup. Oh, no. Oh, we got double hookup. We got double hookup. Ruff is on. You go first, mate. You go first. Oh, lost you lost it? Yep. Lost it? Here, I'm still on. I'm still on. Hold this. Excited. Hold this. <laughs> I think it's just a little grunner, but finally got one on the board. Oh, no. Oh, look at the shark, shark bro. Oh, look at the shark. Holy. Look at the shark. Little baby one, eh? Little bubba. Goodness. I wasn't ready for this. I was not ready for this. Oh. He's right there too. There he is. It's only small, see if you can get it in. Yeah, I'll get him in. He's hooked. He is definitely hooked. It's a little reef. Um, I need this. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Wanna be a grunter, oh, but he got oh. something. That is a small shark. <laughs> Holy, it's hooked him good. Got himself off. Hey. Oh, he took the hook too. <laughs> oh. At least you got your sinker. <laughs> he took the hook. Nah, he was hungry. <laughs> Captain Hook. He was very hungry. Oh. Oh, well, at least I caught something. You've seen it. There's proof. There's proof, hey, Rafa. That's it. <laughs> oh. And of all things to catch a shark, man. What do you... What do you want me to do here? <laughs> what else do you want me to do here? Oh. I told you you catch the bigger one. I did catch the bigger one. I did. But 
fucking sharp. <laughs> So, uh, I don't know if you guys can hear me with the wind, but I'm going to have to end the episode here. We have been hit with a freak storm. We've had to rush to pack up camp this morning, driving in torrential rain. You can't, like, the wind is just insane. So last night's fishing expeditions didn't really go too well, but look at this bloody weather. Holy, <laughs> it went from, went from zero to 60 in, like, nothing. She's just blowing big gales through here, big waves. We just had to go through um, this real bad sandy part on a point and just as we hit that, it pissed down raining. So anyway, that's the episode. That's the way things go, guys. Like, subscribe. Days off, out.